<웃음> 네, 안녕하세요, 여러분. 네, 캐리 님, 네, 반갑습니다. I missed you last week and good to see you again. 엘링메리 님, 어린이날 덕분에 잘 쉬었어요. 네, 저도요. 네. 어린이날. 네, 네. 곤트라바 님, 안녕하세요. 레티시아 님. 네. 에스테파니아. 네. 이제 FD 삼이 님, 루스키 님, 요고 님, 예예 님, 에 모두들 안녕하세요. 반갑습니다. 네. 오늘 날씨가 좀 흐리네요. It's a little cloudy right now in here in n a m y o n g j u city. Yeah. How's the weather everyone? 네, 오늘 today week number 79. 79째 주. 예, 벌써 79째 주예요. 2022년 5월 7일. 예, 수업을 시작하겠습니다. <웃음> Buenas t a r d e s a l a t u d o s I can read, but I don't know what it means. Saludos desde Puebla, Mexico. Hola, maestro. Hola, maestro. Eh, hola. <laughs> hola, Sandra. <clears throat> 네, first word of today is 준비. 준비. 네, do you know what it means? 준비. 네. To prepare, uh, preparation. Uh, to be precise, 준비하다. If there's a word, 하다, then it becomes a verb. So it's to prepare, but just 준비 itself. 네. It's something about prepare, yeah, but it's preparation. Or get ready, yeah. It can be like get ready in some case. Or just preparation as a noun. <coughs> So, 여행 준비, like traveling, preparation, like get ready about the flying ticket, you know, to prepare the flying ticket, or those kind of things, or to bring some baggage, luggage, or whatever you call it. That is 여행 준비, traveling, preparation, exam, preparation, 시험 준비, 준비가 아직 안 끝났어. <laughs> What does it mean? The preparation is not over yet, not completed yet. 준비가 아직 안 끝났어. I'm not ready yet, and practically. And 준비 기간이 길지 않아. Like uh, preparation period. Like some preparation require a lot of time some, or something like that. Okay, anyway, preparation time, a uh, period is not long. Mm -hmm. 준비 기간이 길지 않아. And in this case, like ready, start. 준비, 시작. Yeah, ready, start. And 준비물. 물 in this case is a sino Korean, sino Korean, which means a thing or an object. So 준비물. The whole thing means some object or thing to prepare. for anything or something for anything that is 준비물 so when it comes to traveling it can be like sunglasses or just in flying tickets and some bags I and mean, when it comes to an exam then maybe a pen or eraser those would be 준비물 when you go when you play a baseball game maybe then glove and bat and ball <laughs> that is 준비물 so yeah, 준비 to preparation or to get ready um, pretty much like that could you use 준비 when you're talking about preparing food or cook yeah you can use it you can use it cool or <laughs> yeah 준비물 <laughs> 네. so that was a good question by the way and thank you so and that was the first one and the next one is 계속 되다 계속 되다. Uh, you know what 계속 means? <웃음> uh, supplies. Uh, 준비물. Supplies. It came like that too. Thank you, Link Mary님. 고맙습니다. <웃음> K 
계속, like continuation, continue, being continued, and 계속 되다. Kind of like passive, being continued, yeah, be, to be continued. 계속 되다. <웃음> okay. 경기, sports match, until 1 o'clock in the early morning, yeah, is continued, to be continued. So, the sport, the game is continued until 1 o'clock in the dawn or evening, like 1 a.m., you can tell. So, that's what it means. 경기가 새벽 1시까지 계속 됐어. <웃음> 네, 비가 며칠 계속 될 거야. The rain will be continued for several days. 응, 며칠 means several days. So, 비가 며칠 계속 될 거야. 응, you can tell what it means. And 강의, the lecture, is continued to like behind or after. After a reset, a 10 minute recess. 10 minute taking a rest. Yeah. After this, the lecture was continued. 계속 됐어. So, to be continued. 계속 되다. And the next one is 막다. 막, 막다. Uh, as for the pronunciation, maybe some might, some might say it's 막다. No real pronunciation. But personally, I just 막다, 막다. Maybe. <laughs> uh, doesn't really matter in my opinion. Anyway, 막다, what does it mean? Let's see. Mm, 맑다. Mm. Mm, probably everyone knows, but still, just to make it clear or make it. When this double consonant is followed by 이응, which has no sound, then together it can be sounds like uh, this 기억 comes to this way. So <coughs> it can be sounded like should be 말. Ha, sounds the same, just for information. Yeah, Magda, clear, yeah, exactly, clear. <laughs> so, 물이 맑다, the water is clear, pure, clear, clean, something like that. And clear water, 맑은 물. And 공기, the air, 맑아지다, it's like became, um, to become clear. So, the air is cleaned, like cleared, like it was very dusty, then now it's clean, then 공기가 맑아졌어. What is to be stuck? Uh, do you mean opposition of this one, 계속되다? 멈추다. 끊기다. And 멈추다, to be. It's like to stop or to be stopped, either way. 멈추다. 멈춰지다. <laughs> 멈추다. And 끊기다, to be disconnected. 끊기다. Uh, 끊다, by the way, 끊다 is a to disconnect, active verb, and 끊기다. <coughs> In this way, it's passive one, yeah, 끊기다, to be disconnected. You can use this one. 강의가 끊겼어, like interrupted by something. Disconnection, right? 끊기다. Oh, okay, like to be stuck in the traffic. Oh. Uh, <웃음> 차가 밀리다, 차가 막히다, either way. 
차 usually just car 차가 막히다 to be blocked the car is blocked literally or 차가 밀리다 to be pushed by each between the cars 차가 밀리다 either way 음 차가 막히다 차가 밀리다 we can use it 오늘은 날씨가 맑아요. Oh, the weather is clear today. That's good. <웃음> You're welcome, 건철 아버님. You're welcome. Okay. Um, the air became clearer. 그럼 난 공기가 공기가 맑아졌어. Okay, like 니에이님 said here. Yeah, 하늘이 맑아. The sky is clear. 날씨가 맑아. The weather is clear. Practically the same. Practically the same. Yeah. And 맑은 하늘, like clear sky. 맑은 날씨, clear weather. Practically the same. And 명상을 했더니, like since I did 명상, which is meditation, um, my mental thing, the soul, it, I feel like the soul became clearer. I had stress. Or something like that. But after I did the meditation, now I feel like my soul become became clearer or something like that. <laughs> yeah. 명상을 했더니 정신이 맑아진 것 같아요. You can use 맑다 to your something about your mental health or soul or something like that too. Oh, 피부가 맑다. The skin. 피부가 맑다. It was dirty. Then after you wash it, 피부가 맑다. No dust or no yeah, dirty thing at all. 맑은 내 마음. Oh, my heart is clear. <laughs> Something like that. It came like pure, innocent, or just yeah, not greedy. <laughs> Something like that. It came like that too. Mm. 안녕하세요, 키티님. 네. 어, 덱스터님, 안녕하세요. 좋은 아침이에요. 마음이 맑아. <laughs> Very good. So, 맑다. To be clear. Or sometimes it can be like to be clean. Okay, the next one is 소년. By the way, on week number 69, we covered 소녀. Like 소년과 소녀, if you remember. Mm, like, usually like teenage boy or something like that is 소년. In 소녀 is like teenage girl usually or even younger a kid um, 소년 and 소녀 음. <웃음> 기말 시험 있어서 이번엔 먼저 가봐야겠어요 다들 수고하세요 아우 시험 잘 보시고요 네 시험 준비도 잘 하시고 네, 시험 준비 잘 하시고요 네 그럼 다음에 또 봬요 덱스터님 수녀 <웃음> 수녀 수녀 is like uh, I don't know how to say it in English <웃음> 어, 소녀시대. 어, 오케이. You know it by 소녀시대. That's good. 네. You're welcome, Dexter. 화이팅. 네. 고맙습니다, 링맨이. For encouraging Dexter. 네. And the next one is 소식. 소식. 음, 소식. 음, what does it mean, 소식? News, information, news, yeah, news. It can be like uh, information in a way, in a way. But usually, usually it's just news. Mm, news, that's right. So, 좋은 소식이 있을 거야. Okay, let's uh, practice translating this one. 좋은 소식이 있을 거야. What does it mean? Mm. It will be a good news. Uh, there will be a good news. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah, mm. There will be a good news. 
There will be good news. Oh, there will be good news. Yeah, that's that's right. Perfect. 네 모두들 잘하셨어요. 예, 좋은 소식이 있을 거야. There will be good news. And 소식 들었어? Did you hear the news or have you have you heard the news? 소식 들었어? And 좀 전에 들은 소식 전하겠습니다. I will convey the news that I that I have heard a few moments ago, like few seconds ago or few hours ago. It came like that. Either way. 좀 전에 들은 소식 전하겠습니다. 음, hi, I am from KSA. 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 I'm not sure what KSA stands for. <laughs> Sorry about that. KSA. KSA. Kim Sonte Academy. I'm not sure. <laughs> anyway, 좀 전에 들은 소식 전하겠습니다. Oh, Saudi Arabia. Oh, okay, Kingdom, maybe Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. Okay, now thank you for the information. Now I understand. <laughs> okay, and oh, 작용, 작용. Mm, okay, we have three examples here. 작용. Oh, oh, from Saudi Arabia. So I say shukran for tuning in. Welcome in. Mm, 작용. Okay. 작용 is not that easy, I think. Mm, okay, just I will explain. <웃음> 소식보다 TV news. 다른 단어 맞아요? Oh, 소식, TV news. Uh, TV 소식. Usually when it comes to TV, then news. News is more commonly used. Okay, when it comes to TV news, then we usually just use news. 다음 news, next news. I mean, 다음 news는 the next news is. <coughs> yeah. When it comes to TV news, then we say news. But when it comes to news from my friend, my family, then you, 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 you usually use 소식 mm, Okay That's a good explanation I think Yeah. When it comes to TV news, then we say 뉴스 When it comes to news from friends or News of friends or a family Or people around you Yeah. In those cases, then you, we, say, we usually say 소식 yeah, I, That's what I can tell And you're welcome Kerry님 <laughs> Greetings from Philippines. Oh, hello. Uh, hello. How? <laughs> 안녕하세요. All the way to Philippines. <laughs> yeah, 반갑습니다. <laughs> Philippines. Okay. Um. Okay. 대기권 밖에서는 대기권 is like uh, when it comes to uh, let's say there is an earth. Mm, okay. The, this one is earth. That air. Like this, <laughs> okay. Let's this every dot here are just air, and air is around the earth, and <coughs> we call it 대기권. 대기권, like atmosphere. I don't know that 대기권. So outside of 대기권. Then the gravity doesn't operate. So 작용, okay, I, just to make it easier to understand, I just just giving you a verb about 작용, 작용하다. It's like act, to act or to operate. But you don't use this, this 작용하다. When something is operated by a person, then you don't use it. Usually you use it when Something is operated by nature or by a thing that people have made. Then you can use 작용 or 작용하다. So, <laughs> so, yeah, 
the gravity doesn't operate outside of um, atmosphere, like outside of the long distance from the, the planet, gravity doesn't um, operate, something like that. <coughs> and okay, this this one is kind of complicated. Okay, let's divide this one into three parts. This one, and this one, and this one. So, <coughs> this one is due to this. Okay, so the, the, the decision which doesn't make sense at all. Yeah, 그 말도 안 되는 결정은 yeah, the decision which doesn't make sense at all is probably due to the operation by uh, mass psychology or crowd psychology, mob psychology, something like that. 군중 심리, a crowd 심리. 심리 is like psychology. So the the decision that doesn't make sense at all is probably due to the operation of 군중 심리. A 무중력 상태, no gravity condition, 무중력 상태. And that's a very good. <laughs> it looks like a donut. <laughs> okay. <laughs> looks yummy. <laughs> yeah, so, I hope you understand what 작용 means. Like, maybe this, is, this one is a physics term, like ac action and reaction. 작용 and 반작용. Like acting, interacting. Oh, 상호작용. Interaction, like uh, we don't use 상호작용, like interaction between people or persons. You say interaction between things or natural things or natural. Mm, phenomenon or no then you use 상호작용 maybe 상호작용 between earth and the moon 상호작용 interaction interaction between something and something kind of like interaction or operate or something like that oh 전 문장을 한국 한국어로 말해주세요 I'm reading Korean 대기권 밖에서는 중력이 작용하지 않아. 그 말도 안 되는 결정은 군중 심리의 작용에 의해서일 거야. 음, complicated one. <웃음> 작용과 반작용 and 상호작용. 어, oh, 뭐뭐에 의해서, like due to, something happen due to, something. Yeah, that kind of due to. Okay. 그 말도 안 되는 결정. Oh, 말도 안 되다, by the way. Hey, that's ridiculous. That doesn't make sense at all. 말도 안 돼. When someone says something, 말도 안 돼. If someone says that, if the other people say that, then that's nonsense. That doesn't make sense at all. And 말도 안 되는 결정. The decision that which doesn't make sense at all, yeah. So the decision doesn't make sense at all is probably due to that operation operated operation by this 군중 심리, like 군중, like crowd psychology or mob psychology or mass of mass psychology or something like that when people gather together and somehow they think about the same thing they all together have the same opinion about a thing okay. mass psychology something like that <laughs> oh ridiculous absurd yeah that's right so it's just an idiom 
음, you, you can use mild under that as an adjective about this 결정, like in this case. Mob mentality. Oh, okay. Mob, mob mentality. Hold the effect. Hurt. Something like that, I guess. Yeah. Hold the effect. I have to look up though. Mm. I think that's right. Yeah, something like that. I don't know how do you, how do you pronounce this one? Hardy, hard maybe hard. I don't know. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, yeah, I think that's right. 작용하다, 작동하다, 같아요? Oh, okay, that's a good, good question. 작용하다, 작동하다. Oh, 작동 is used when a machine, when machine operates. 작동하다. And 작용하다, some, when some, ah, uh, 이론, like theory. Is oper works when some theory or when something is operated by a nature or something like that. Nature, natural phenomenon, phenomena. Yeah. Then you use 작용하다. When a machine operates, then you say 작동하다. That's a that's a difference between those two. Yeah, that was a very good question, Yeye yeah, Nim. Yeah. Yeah. I hope my explanation was uh, um, good enough. <laughs> So, 작용하다. I think it's kind of hard to understand, I guess, but I hope you can understand. And if you ask again, I will try to answer. And you're welcome, yeah, yeah, name. 네. And the next one is hurry. Hurry. <coughs> 네, what does it mean, hurry? Oh, 부작용. Like, 부작용. Literally, it's, it's not operating, but practically it means side effect like to operate badly <laughs> 부작용 like when it comes to a medicine you you took medicine and you had a side effect that is 부작용 mm. that's a good one link many name 고맙습니다 and hurry back like waste like uh like this area if you can if you see my body Oh yeah, this area, that is like both sides, that is waste. So, um, hurry. Hurry를 양 옆으로 돌려. By the way, I copy and paste these ones first. Like, hurry. 양옆, like both side, 돌리다, to turn. So, hey, do this. This side and this side. 허리를 양 옆으로 돌려. Mm. And 허리 디스크. This disc, like D-I-S-K, disc. Like, <coughs> waste disc. In order to, or if you want to, prevent. 허리 디스크. Then you have to grow the waist muscle. That's what it means. Yeah, 허리 디스크를 예방하려면 허리 근육을 키워야 돼. And okay, the tree 심다 is like to plant. Back then, the tree I plant, or oh, the tree they plant back then <coughs> is now have grown all the way to my waist. It's like... Mm. Okay. Let's say you planted a tree. It was like this big when you planted. Then now it has grown all the way to like let's say this is waist. 
height. Oh, the ways. That's what it means. 예, 그때 심은 나무가 내 허리 높이까지 grew. 자랐어. Or instead of grew, you can also say came, 왔어. You can use the word 오다, to come. Yeah, it was down over there, down, but it had came all the way to my waist. 내 허리 높이까지 왔어. You can use 왔어 in this case as well. But usually just 자랐어, I guess. Yeah. So, 허리, like waist, W-A-I-S-T, waist. That's 허리. And the next one is 골, 골. Oh. 골. Okay. Like in English, we could say come up to. Oh, that's right, come up to. Although it yeah, come up to here, yeah, something like that. Mm, thank you. 원래 이 문장들은 의미가 의미를 이해했지만 내 언어로 번역할 때 너무 어려워요. 그렇게 하면 normal real sam 너무 불안해. Oh, that's normal, you know. Ah, uh, okay. Ah, uh, I I can same goes for me. Same goes to me. Yeah, it's like. When someone asks me to translate some English sentences, uh, it's, it's quite hard, not easy. <laughs> it takes time. I had, I had to think about it for a long time. Uh, it happens a lot, quite often, frequently. Like, 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 I mean, I just can't translate right away. I have to think about it for a long time, then I can translate. Even though I understood what it means, uh, to express the same thing into a different language is totally difficult one, in, especially like Korean and English, the structure is very different. Mm, so uh, that happens. Okay, that's not only, uh, you're, you're not alone, so don't worry about it, yeah, yeah, Nim. <laughs> 네, 그러니까 흔한 일이에요. 저도 영어를 한국말로 번역할 때 바로 바로 번역 못 하고 좀 생각을 좀 해야 될 때가 많아요. 그러니까 구조가 언어 구조가 많이 다르기 때문인데 어, 그걸 너무 자기가 너무 실력이 부족하다 생각 어, 그렇게 생각할 필요 없습니다. 오케이 골 음, 음, 오케이 okay. the struggle is real, my friend. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, and thank you. 고맙습니다, 케빈님. 네. So, 오늘 몇골 넣었어? It's, it's like, how many goals have you put in today? Or how many goals did you score? Uh, how many goals did you score today? That's what it means. Big hug, <laughs> 쌤. 고맙습니다, 예예님. <laughs> 네. So, like, when it, when it comes to sports, it can be like goal, G O A L. And if I or if we score one more goal, then it's tie score. Okay? Just one goal, then tie. 한 골만 더 넣으면 동점이야. Okay. 골이 깊다. Goal has another meaning. Uh, let's say there's a mountain like very steep mountain like in another steep one then like this area you say core core keep the the core is deep you know usually between two huge and steep mountain then you can say core keep the and also when person, uh, there are two persons there. 골이 깊다. The core between these two persons is very deep. Means 
they kind of hate each other for such a for such a long time. Like they don't talk to each other due to because usually because they hate each other, and it has been like that for a long time. Then you can say. 고리 깊다 like 두 사람 사이에 between those two persons 고리 깊다 고리 깊어 uh, <웃음> 고리 깊다 can be used this either this one like between two mountains or between two persons either way mm, valley something like valley and crotch Oh, yeah, something like that, something like that. You can use something like that. 원한 유감. Like, they hate each other. 고리 깊다. Deep-seated hatred. <laughs> yeah, something like that. Yeah, that's right. 고리 깊다. Can be like that. Chasm between them. Chasm. Yeah, the chasm. I think so. Gorge. Gorge. <laughs> yeah, gorge. Hopkok. Yeah. yeah. So many <laughs> words that I didn't know. <laughs> I'm learning a lot today. <laughs> so, Kori Kipta. Uh, you can use Kori Kipta either way. And these three are kind of a slang, slangs. Kolo kada. It means to die. Kolo <laughs> kada. It's a slang. We are teaching the teacher now. Yeah. Kumasmida <laughs> for teaching me. And kolo kada means to die. And kori nada to get angry. Suddenly get angry. It's not really, really angry. It's not like that. Like, 고리나다. Just kind of angry. <laughs> and 골 때리다. 골 can be like a brain, in a way. 골 때리다. Oh, that shock. That is shocking. 골 때리다. Or, that is so ridiculous. Ah, oh, 골 때리다. <laughs> that is something. When something is very ridiculous, or something is very kind of shocking, in a way. 골 때리다. Uh, or you uh, making you having some trouble to figure out something. Uh, having make you have trouble finding a way. Something like that can be uh, can be like that. It can be used in that kind of case as well. But usually, when something is very shocking, in a very ri ridiculous way, then 골 아, ah, that's 골 때리네. 골 때리네. 골머리, oh, 골치, same thing. 골치 아프다. Yeah, same. Yeah, it's pretty much the same. 골, 골, 골치, 골치. But you don't you say you don't say 골치 때리다. Mm. These two idiom practically the same. 골치 아프다. Not really the same. 골치 아프다. Ah. In making a hard time, ah, oh, my, my headache. I get a headache thinking about it. Cool chapter that. I'll say it's a different one. Okay, it's just different. Cool that is that is shocking, ridiculous, and cool chapter that. Ah, it's stressful. Cool chapter that. Mind blowing. Which one? Oh, this one? No, no, no. It sounds different. The nuance is different. Mind blowing sounds like when something is good, I think. But 골 때리다, it's not like that. Ah, 골 때리다, 골 때리다. Or maybe you when something is very funny in a ridiculous way, then you can also say 골 때리다. Ah, uh, yeah, 골 때리다. Give someone a hard time. Kind of or in a way, but not exactly, not exactly say 
same. I'll say that's kind of different. Just, ah, uh, 골때리다. 골때리다. Man, I feel like 골때려. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, cold, cold is like to snore, snore, sneeze, snore. I hate to go between snore and sneeze. Ah, uh, cold, cold is like to snore. Yeah, so it's different. No steals. Mm. Uh, cold is just snore. It's not different. And okay. So cold lo gada to die. Cold nada. Can I get angry? Cold te nada. That's ridiculous. Cold um, chapda. I had headache or stress about something. Cold chapda. So cold has many different meanings. By the way, that's what I'm trying to say here. And the next one is 공업. 공업. Mm, what does it mean? 공업. Cold data. So basically, heightened level of ridiculous. Yeah, I think, yeah, pretty much like that. Cold data. Mm, I think that's right. And 공업 industry exactly. 공업 도시 industrial city. And 경 is Sino Korean, Sino Korean which means light and heavy. So light industry and heavy industry. So 공업 is just industry, like manufacturing industry or something like that. 공업. And oh, already last word of today is 그중 그중. Do you know what it means? 그중. It's like 음, 그중. Like two words came together. 그중. Among them, 그중, among them, basically. So, yeah, among them, exactly. Between them. <laughs> More like among them, yeah. <laughs> so, 거기, 그림들이 많은데, there are many drawings or pictures there. But one of them, I drew. I drew it, one of them. 거기 그림들이 많은데 그중 하나는 내가 그렸어. <웃음> And this one, if there are number of like several boxes are there, like if if, then 그중 제일 큰거 가져와. Bring the biggest one among them. That's what it means. 음악 공업. Oh, we don't say 음악 공업. 음악 산업. Okay. Ah, oh, that's a good question. Um, 산업. It's a different word. 공업 and 산업. Maybe I just have to. Uh, And that was a very good question. 공업, <coughs> 산업. And both can be translated as industry, but this one is more focused on manufacturing, like making a product, like physical product. And this one maybe has a broader meaning. Like music industry, 음악 산업, content 산업, like content industry, or game, like video games, 
game 산업. You don't say game 공업, content 공업. You, you don't say like that. Just 산업. And 산업. Can 산업 can be used physical thing? I think so. Yeah. Computer 산업. Oh, I guess a little different. Like physical product. When it comes to a physical product, then you use just manufacturing. You use 공업, like contents or maybe carton. 만화 산업, 영화 산업, 영, movie, video games, or some graphic designing, something like that. Then you use 산업. Both can be translated as an industry, by the way. Entertain, yeah, entertainment 산업. Like not visible, not physical product. Then you can use 산업. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> So, size everywhere this is all. Oh. <laughs> 음악 산업, 영화 산업, something like that. Yeah, that was a very good question. Okay, 그중, like 그중, like among them. Yeah, uh, again, 거기 그림들이 많은데 <웃음> 그중 하나는 내가 그렸어. 상자가 the box. 여러 개, not only one or two, just several several of them if there are several boxes then bring the biggest one among them 그중 like among them intangible 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 like Invisible thing, usually. I think so. Usually, maybe I'm not 100% sure as for now, but maybe I have to think about it for a long time. But I think so. Yeah, when it comes to movie, like not, not physical product, you know, not manufacturing, then you can use sanop as industry. <coughs> nah. Yes, so that's it for today and that's it for today and I hope you enjoyed learning together I enjoyed teaching and I learned a lot too so thank you everyone and yeah 준비 yeah. oh it's just occurred to me South San Francisco where I live is 공업도시 it says so on the mountain nearby mm, 공업도시 so, like many factory, if there are many factories in South San Francisco, then you can say 공업 도시. 음, 방송을 준비를 돼서 감사합니다, 선생님. 선생님은 장미처럼요. <웃음> Thank you, Kelly님. Roses are beautiful. 장미는 예쁘죠? <웃음> 저도 예쁜가요? <웃음> 고맙습니다. Time flies when you're having fun. Oh, 고맙습니다, 나타샤님. Yes, time flies. That's indeed. Yeah, 보라가님 또 봬요. Thank you for today. You're welcome, 권철아버님. You're welcome, J, uh, JFD님. <laughs> Just came here. Mm, you can see the live streaming after, even though it's over, you can watch it later. <laughs> Oh, in gi gigantic letters, industrial industrial city. Okay. <laughs> oh, the Martin says okay. <laughs> hey, you two have a good weekend, Gon Goncharov님. A hey, 영화 산업, you can use like 영화 산업, mu a movie industry. 영화 산업, exactly. Yeah, 고맙습니다, 예예님. Yeah, 링메리님, 예 yeah, 고맙습니다. 네 모두들, 예 yeah, 그럼 또한주잘 지내시고요. Oh, by the way, uh. On May 21st, uh, when it comes to this month, May, the one, uh, 21st, which is Saturday, there won't be, in Korean time, yeah, there won't be a live stream, uh, session. So, just for information. But other Saturdays, there will be a session. So, so see you next week. Yeah, 모두들 잘 지내시고 건강 잘 챙기시고요. 그럼 다음 주 토요일에 또 봬요. 네, 그럼 네 모두들 네 
잘 지내시고요. 또 봬요. 고맙습니다.